이 안에서 어쩌나? How's it going everyone? Today we're gonna be talking about how Flex Ninja achieved his internet fame. Now hopefully you enjoyed the video and be sure to subscribe for more content like this. Anyway, Flex Ninja actually started his content 8 years ago. So what he was mostly doing is streaming on Twitch. When he started mostly on January 2018, you can see he had potentially 9 viewers and going around 30 average viewers until that is Valorant came out. He was actually known for being a pretty good player in Black Squad. He was doing pretty good for a game that's Black Squad. Now Black Squad is still a huge game, but it's nothing compared to the size of Valorant. I'm pretty sure he basically got bored of the game, as you can see more and more different games being traded and tried out. He was making a lot of montages for Black Squad. I guess I might be wrong here, but I guess after you do this for 2-3 to three years, it kind of gets boring, right? That's why he tried montages on games like Fortnite, even uh, Call of Duty, and then even Valor. Key point being Valorant here. He started streaming Valorant and he started making highlights from his Twitch stream to Valorant. I guess the community took point here because there's been a few controversies. Players can definitely notice if there is a Black Squad YouTuber missing. What's very interesting as he started streaming and uploading Valorant content, he gained more and more viewers. That's on the June 20th, he hit 283 average viewers. And if we look on October 2020, the average viewers is now over a thousand. And I'm pretty sure this is only gonna keep growing. So how did Flex Ninja hit Valorant's sweet spot? Well, the answer is pretty simple. He used a niche way nobody else was doing. Omen tricks. If anyone of you played Valorant in closed beta, Omen was one of the most popular agents. His smokes and tricks, like the leap shadows or whatever, made him fun to play. Anyone can play Omen, anyone can record Valorant gameplay and upload it to YouTube. Not everyone can make good, interesting tricks and play in very high rank. I mean, I have a splash. What do you mean? You flash me. Back side, back side, back side. That's why it's like the flash is looking for you. It's too crazy. Come clear. Yo. I'm walling mid, let's play it. Nice. I kill. I kill. Who's coming up? Nice. 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 Flex Ninja also has something a lot of other people can't have or simply don't want to have a charismatic personality. That's what made Flex Ninja so likable. His charismatic personality basically made a lot of people watch him from the very beginning of our. Simply what he was doing in his spare time. He was just streaming on Twitch. That's it. Then what happened is he took good bits of Twitch, 
and uploaded it to YouTube and it instantly made his YouTube grow. You see, it's an ongoing cycle that never ends. The Twitch viewers go to YouTube and the YouTube viewers come to Twitch. That simply makes an unstoppable growth for Flex Ninja. Now you probably know that high watch time means a higher chance of YouTube promoting your videos. And Flex Ninja was very entertaining. So what happened is some of his videos even reached half a million, which is huge for Val at this time. That made other YouTubers hang out with him and talk about him even more. So today, everybody, what we are going to be talking about if you just joined in, if you have been here and here, you probably already know. Um, we're going to be talking about Flex Ninja. He is a YouTuber who recently blew up. He is an Omen main. I think that he played almost exclusively Omen all the way to Immortal in the beta. He did hit Immortal too. I There's even more to this. Flex Ninja started playing with Hiko and Ninja, one of the biggest Valorant Twitch streamers there are. This up short already. We're whiffing. Yeah, they're up. He just pushes me oh. on you. Well, I'm down. Well, I'm down. One in you. One. Slightly oh. sharp. You dead? Thirty seconds. Hey, one more. Cut yourself. Enemy remains. Last one sharp. Raise up. Raise up. Didn't see anything come out yet. Nice speaking with you. Cipher dead. Wait. One long. Yeah. Long as well. Inside. Inside. Under hookah. Nice. Okay, nice. Fuck, Imagine stream sniping and losing. Imagine admitting <laughs> you're stream sniping, responding to me in chat when I say stuff. And <laughs> I'm at least playing like really well against. All right, good game today, boys. I am teasing. My camera's about to die. Have a good one. Thanks for playing. GG's. Busio. Thank you. You're cracked. Nika. Flex Ninja. You're cracked too. So what now? Flex Ninja sits simply at the top, growing every day. This is a story you could tell to your grandchildren. Ninja is simply one of the biggest streamers for Valorant there is. I think this is a great success story, telling you how small Twitch streamers or small YouTubers can rise to the top and play with big stars as well. I think it can also tell you if you're doing YouTube and having fun and doing your own thing, such as secret Omen setups or whatever, you will have a lot of fun and you will grow as well. If you entertain others, you will get the results back. Now the last thing it tells you, if you put a lot of grind in, as you see with Flex Ninja, he didn't have good results in 2018, he has great, great results now. And I think this can apply for any YouTuber or content creator or anything in that regard. Hopefully you enjoyed this video, if you would subscribe that would help me out a lot. But if you would give a chance at my other videos I made and put hours into, that would help me out a lot as well. I want to thank you for watching this video. And yeah, this is Fatman, sign out. Peace, guys.